Tesla could have a new Model Y Plus coming in 2024 with additional range and possibly unlocking range with 4680 batteries. Now, what will this new Model Y be like? Let's find out with the help of Torque News Tesla reporter Jeremy Johnson, who has an interesting coverage on this topic at torquenews.com. So Tesla's new Model Y Plus may be coming in 2024. And here's what Jeremy has to say. He says Tesla will have a new Model Y in 2024 and it is going to be better than what tesla has now according to ryan shaw what will the range of this new model y vehicle be well first of all let me say that if it's going to come in 2024 the standards for range for electric vehicles in 2024 which is year and a half from now are going to be different than what the standards are today nowadays we are okay with 250 350 miles range but in 2024 where we probably will see new batteries with better capacities better density we're supposed to see the ranges of maybe 500 plus miles per single charge now panasonic is investing a few billion dollars in a second u.s electric vehicle battery factory in kansas to supply a new high capacity battery for tesla according to various new sources in fact the kansas governor the other day tweeted and i also tweeted on my twitter page at torque news auto handle that panasonic is investing four billion dollars in kansas city and that's going to hire about four thousand people to build electric vehicle batteries not only for tesla but also probably for other car companies but i assume tesla will probably buy them all now this is important because tesla's new model y in 2024 is going to have much more range than the model y does now but it will be because of the 4680 batteries and the new capacity that 4680 batteries are going to allow tesla Panasonic is also working to increase battery energy density by a fifth by 2030. This means getting more battery in the same amount of space. If you do some quick math and a 20% increase in range, that would mean a 396 mile range Model Y in 2030 instead of the 330 miles of range. But that is eight years from now. What about 2024? Well, that's what Jeremy said but i honestly think that by 2030 that's eight years from now we should have at least 1000 mile range which is very possible recently we wrote about 4680 batteries and tesla likely going to have software updates that unlock range from the batteries right now tesla is cell constrained and vehicles from giga texas are mostly being produced with the 2170 cells that's the size of the battery of course Eventually, Tesla will have enough 4680 batteries to have uh, that be the primary battery source for Tesla vehicles. Now, Model Y of the future. Um, Elon Musk has predicted that Model Y will be the best-selling vehicle in the world in a few years. The Model Y is being built in all four major Tesla factories. Fremont factory in California, Giga Texas in Austin, Texas, Giga Berlin in Germany in Brandenburg and Giga Shanghai in Shanghai, China. Tesla has even made the test model Ys at Giga Berlin that are going to be able, you know, Tesla is going to be able to sell them recently. They got the approval as I reported at Torque News YouTube channel. Range unlocks with 4680 batteries could give the Giga Texas Model Y close to 400 miles of range right now. But these batteries are in scarce supply at the moment. It's though to see when the 4680 batteries will reach large scale mass production, making them more of a luxury item at the moment. Here's what I'm thinking. I don't think Tesla can unlock the range possibility of model y why because since tesla doesn't have enough model and enough 4680 batteries tesla can't make like uh 5000 model y's with uh, unlocked range 4680 batteries with 400 miles and uh, the rest of the teslas make them like what 300 or 200 300 350 miles uh, of single uh, uh, range of for single charge i don't know now charging will also improve as tesla is moving to 
to um, V3 superchargers soon. A Model Y in 2024 will charge much faster than a Model Y today due to the supercharger network and improvements in the batteries of the Model Y. Now, to be honest, charging speed is one of the bottlenecks for electric vehicles today, friends. If you are charging at home, that's fine because you can come home at five o'clock after work, six o'clock after work, and then you plug it in and you forget about charging and going to gas station until tomorrow morning and you have enough range, especially if you have a wall charger mounted on your wall of garage, then you're you're much better shape. Um, but if you're going to take your car to a nearby charging station and it's a slow charger, then you're going to uh, stop there for one hour and that's going to give you now only about three to four miles of charge per one charging hour. If you stay there at two hours, that's going to give you maximum 10 miles of charging. That's not enough for two hours. One day I had, I was in a similar situation. I went to a charging station. I decided I will take a walk. No, I didn't at that time know that that was a slow charger station. I didn't know about those things and didn't pay much attention. So I walked for about two hours thinking my car would be at least 80% charged. And then I come to my car and then I see, wow, only 10 miles in two hours. Well, now I would expect Tesla to continue to innovate on the Model Y, improving features of it, both in the structure of the car as well as with over-the-air software updates. I, took, uh, I would look for a Model Y in 2024 with 2170 batteries to have about 350 miles of range for the long range and to have a range of 400 miles with 4680 batteries. But that will have to be unlocked with an extra purchase via software, thinks uh, Jeremy Johnson from Torque News. Jeremy also says, um, that he is expecting Tesla is to continue to innovate. Now, what do you think of, of the 2024 Model Y will be like? I will also have the link of uh, Ryan Shaw's video in the description of this video so you can peruse it. Do you think Tesla in 2024 will have a uh, 400 miles of range with a single charge? And do you think it will be with fully 4680 batteries be available in 2024 Tesla? I don't know. I would like to hear from you, friends. What do you think on that? Now, speaking of um, the batteries, we earlier this year we reported that Tesla is a once-in-a-generation type of company. The business is continually disrupting itself, and the latest disruption was that Tesla's uh, introduction of the 4680 battery cells. These batteries are a step up from Tesla's other cell types, like 2170, and um, we're looking forward to see what these batteries can do for Tesla in the coming years, in 2024 or in 2030. By the way, do you think Tesla will use the 4680 batteries in 2030 or we will see different battery structures and different battery architectures in 2020, actually in 2030? Well, let's see. Time will show. I'll look forward to your comments. See what do you think, guys? In the meantime, this is Armin Harayan from TorqueNews.com with the help of Jeremy Johnson, Torque News YouTube, uh, Torque News Tesla reporter, and uh, please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news and also ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla coverage. God bless you everyone. Peace be with you, with all of you. Give us thumbs up for this report if you found it helpful and I'll see you soon in our next report. Have a great day.